That's one of the areas where Miami struggled a year ago. They did not have depth. Jim Laranaga now with nine available scholarship players, and that depth is truly helping him here in game one. Think about what is going on in college basketball, and you get an opportunity to play a meaningful game on day one and bring the interest of college basketball as McMahon knocks down his second three-pointer. You've got another senior, Ryan McMahon, who's playing in front of his, his parents, I'm sure, making the trip from Sarasota, coming to check him out. He comes up with a steal as well. McMahon with eight points, looking for his third triple, and he's got it. Chris Likes has felt like he's been fouled a number of times attacking the basket and hasn't gotten the call. Ryan McMahon creating separation. It was so good from distance in that first half. A lot because North Carolina's had a number of great freshmen, but like Kobe White a year ago, but Kobe White had so many more tools around him. Oh, oh there's the play of the year so far. Granted, it's early, but show me something better. Tuesday at Miami, 87-74, shot 53% as a team, and they've got a three. You want somebody who can score outside? Well, Ryan McMahon can do that from extreme. Just 32% shooting in the first half for Youngstown State. Deep into the shot clock on their first possession. McMahon. Trying to create some daylight. Difficult shot, and he hit it. High degree of difficulty. He made it look easy. Knocked down a couple of late threes in the first half. Misfires there. Challenges McMahon and gets it to Wara. And he'll bend that rim again. Uh, Jordan Wara is the one right now uh, that is putting on a clinic. Step backs. Indiana State's playing pretty good defense. He is just having better offense. Ryan McMahon pretty good at shooting the three ball as well. Louisville has just been on fire right here again. That's just a poor closeout. Uh, you have to close out better on Ryan McMahon. Okay, when you can run a second unit as talented as this one, McMahon drills the three. The sharpshooter in his senior year has been on fire. Not an easy place to sell. He sold my parents. I told him he recruited my parents just as hard as he recruited me. He knocked with a right. Been on fire to start this year. When Perry pointing at his guys, telling him, go. McMahon tries another and buries him. Ryan McMahon back to back threes. Nice. Only up five, but really starting to hit their stride. Ryan McMahon's got back to back threes for this Cardinals team. A oh, great wow. feed. Yes. And Dwayne Sutton pays it off. They've been in the Big South, so again, they have 14 players that are freshmen or sophomores. They, another great feed from McMahon. Wow, he is really doing it all in this first half. They're there when they need it most. Mozone, great feed, blocked at the rim. Steven Enoch, a rejection. Three McMahon, he drew it. Enoch. And then Ryan McMahon trailing the play. You have to find more the ball. Baseline shot, nothing but air by Johns Jr. Michigan shooting it horribly here. Over on an eight to one. Just a matter of time. No layups at all out of Michigan in transition. Tip two, three times and picked off. Gibson trying to jam that ball in. McMahon. Nice pass. Key for Wara. Xavier Johnson, one of the better guards in the ACC, and if he can knock down jumpers, he is so quick, so difficult to keep out of the lane. How about the response from Ryan McMahon? You have to get your number up above 30% from beyond the arc. McMahon, his second three. Well, this right here is what McMahon does so well. Move without the ball, no communication, and that time he made them pay. Well, 6-0 spurt for the Cardinals. McMahon. Man, he is pure. Would gladly have his yard <laughs> well, toilet paper if he's able to win the ACC and would appreciate you doing so. Absolutely. He'll love it. Uh, you know, our volleyball team just made the, the, the final eight volleyball sub. And going to Kentucky and Indiana and in places in the, in the region. And Darius Perry, I believe, scored 28 points in that game. And Stephen Enoch finishes off another alley from a beautiful find from Ryan McMahon. Too strong by Grant. Three. 
surprised to see some of those low numbers for some of those high-powered ACC teams. I think once conference play starts, all those numbers will lift. Forrest spins and has it stripped away. Darius Perry comes up with the loose ball for Louisville. The defense possession right there by Louisville. McMahon behind the back pass to the corner for Perry. Got it! Yeah, nice play. Struggle to hold guys accountable to play a certain way as well. So it is a great challenge as a coach when you can't go full 5 on 5. Oh, did Ryan McMahon need that one? Division one coaching job with division one head coaching job. Ryan McMahon, beautiful English off the window. Oh, high off the glass or the English, whichever you choose. Kind of reminds me of my man Dougie Fresh. <laughs> He's become much more than just a specialist. He really has, and his ability to get, put the ball on the floor and get to the basket, as we see once again from Ryan McMahon. And he struggled shooting the ball from three, but no struggle. Did you do that on purpose? No. <laughs> <laughs> McMahon playing with some confidence here this afternoon. We're not getting their best Ryan McMahon shooting the basketball. And of course, defensively, they're better with Darius Perry and Fresh Kimball on the floor to start games. But right now, before the game, and one of the things that he said that Chris Mack told the guards was just to push the ball up the floor. Stop. But you don't allow guys to be able to play basketball. That's part of the game. McMahon, yes, a three-pointer. He is able to come in off the bench, run the point. He's dynamic, athletic, and can really see plays straight back to him. How about that feed from Ryan McMahon to the cutting David Johnson in the lead? Bros for Louisville. Does, there's going to be a dribble at. So dribble at him, and he immediately goes back door. And he went back door on a great defender. What a pass by McMahon to Williamson. Time friend is playing with his nephew Jim, who's uh, assistant on the you, with the women's team. At, uh, Duke. Playing with an awful lot of confidence and efficiency. BC back in front. Ryan McMahon, the floater, off glass and in. Well, you're a shooter and you're on the outside. And you're struggling like Bryce has over the last couple weeks. You've got to catch it and let it go. McMahon, six oh, for oh. six. And that's a career high in triples. Trying to find an alley. Little scoop off the glass. He just wanted to prove that he he doesn't just make three-point shots. New York Watch this. It looks like a little probe, and like he's going to kick it out, and then all of a sudden it's a, it's a one-power dribble, short little dribble, and then the scoop. Watch this dribble right there. That's the one. That, that <laughs> dribble. Sutton trying to finish. Skips it back. McMahon buys time three. Got it. How about that? Floor. That's this wide open. Take that shot. Nope, nope, nope. I'm going to take it back. And drop. It wasn't a foul. You got to scrap. <laughs> I don't mean it's a foul just because the guy's six foot nothing. McMahon, nobody got a hand up. Well, that's bad business. Timeout coming, I think. The key with nobody All around. right, let's see why. Sard just backs off. Instead of going up and into him, White. Didn't exactly fight the screen, but you've got a no personnel. Look, Sars backing up. You, you, here's how you can tell McMahon's going to make. At large bids is usually about 31 or 32. Oh, yeah. Now, he doesn't miss many. Neither does he. No. Ryan McMahon, a 46% three point shooter, top 25 in the country. Sears has been by 20 in the zone, really bothered. Shot 27%. Deep one for Ryan McMahon. And the Sarasota Florinator, who has a place defensively, he's improved in a lot of areas. And this is wow. why he's starting. He's got the green light from basically anywhere beyond the logo because somebody's in foul trouble or something's not going well. You know, Gorier is really important that he comes off the bench and gets that slasher. McMahon again. Right there by McMahon defensively. There he is right here. He's got to become, though, not one dimension. He's a guy that can put the ball on the deck, get free. I'm going to tell you, he's got a good future. Man. Ryan and McMahon with his third three of the game. I see a little shootout. McMahon and Bayon. Yep. Three-point shooting guy to D-Bay. Let's lob up on top. McMahon. Louisville trying to go over the top. And Williams with a chance for three.
Nice pass diagonally by Ryan McMahon. Why can't you be nice, Dick? I love you be nice. I love you. McMahon off to Eda. The route is on. Because without his 25, 30 points on the road, can't win the ball game. Ryan McMahon knocked Man. down at three. And you and I know who he was pointing to. And then Ryan McMahon, as good a shooter as there is in the ACC. It's more than eight and a half minutes gone by as we get big Monday started. Louisville in its sixth year in the league, trying to win its first conference title. And Ryan McMahon, it's called for the Florida State foul. A little double drag up top, and then they go set the stagger for Ryan McMahon. Now a bench player playing off the ball a lot. Nearly a turnover. It is a turnover. Walker kept it out of the backcourt, but threw it to Perry. McMahon, how deep is that? Not too deep for Ryan McMahon. And then these are two more favorites that I think uh, are, are in the top eight to get there. Ryan McMahon got open with the fake and buries another one. When he makes the catch here, gives a little shot fake, never moves, and then just dribbles it once, sets his feet. Johnson almost gave it away. McMahon with a three. Force my belief. Now let's celebrate the old guys on senior night. Said I hate that more than anything. And it's not applying undue pressure to the kids, but I want clean games. There's a slam by Johnson. And now the Cardinals really putting this thing on ice. Double of attention that is paid to Thomas Walter Tenzai, but that opens up opportunities for his teammates as Ryan McMahon <laughs> comes out firing. Ryan McMahon back into the game for Louisville. Nice feed inside. The layup is good by David Johnson. 